Hi everyone. Um, so I had some time, um, you know, in between getting stuff done today. So I thought, why not just do a quick get ready with me? Cause I also, I don't know, it's been a long morning and I want to feel pretty. I would have done this this morning like I should have, but I pretty much just rolled out of bed and started doing errands. So here we are. Um, I'm just going to take a Neutrogena Hydro Boost because my skin's a little oily because it's hot out. And I'm sure there's going to be mascara or something from yesterday. I had my makeup on for like, oh my god, 13 hours, maybe even longer, um, yesterday, so... A little bit of mascara, mostly just oil. Okay, perfect. All right, so um, the other reason I wanted to do this is because I got the Culture Palette by Juvia's Place because it's on sale right now. Ulta's doing like a huge like spring sale. Look at how beautiful this palette is. Look at all the shiny colors. Look at like, this is just so beautiful, and it was finally on sale, so I was like, eh, why not? Um, because I love Juvia's Place's products so much, I just, I don't know, I want to try out the sparkly shades, especially this one. I'm going to use this one today. It's like coral, but it reflects like green. It's really cool. So I'm probably going to use that on my eyelid, to be honest. I don't know, I just, I have ideas. We'll see how they go, though. I almost forgot to take off my ring. That would have sucked. All right. So, um, face is clean. <laughs> um, I'm just going to take my uh, Essence uh, Glow Serum Primer. Actually, you know what? I'm going to open both because I struggled in my last video. Um, so I got the Halo Glow Liquid Filter. I got the color Fair, because I always keep saying that Fair Light is a little too orange. So I got Fair. Um, and, you know, we'll see how that goes. It it could be too light. It could be just enough. Um, but, yeah, the other colors are just a little too orangey for me. I have a weird complexion as far as, like, pale. Um, so I got Fair. So we're going to test that out. I'm actually going to shake it a little bit more because I don't know how long this one's been sitting. Okay. All right, so, just get as much as I can. If you're wondering why I'm doing this this weird, like, backwards way, it's because the pump is broken on this particular one. I do have a new one, but there's so much left in this bottle. I'm just, like, not about to throw that out. Ooh, that was plenty. Okay, I think. All right. Oh, wait, did I not open this? Oh, God. <laughs> Shit. I literally just said, oh, I'm going to open it, and then I closed it like a doofus. Here we go. <laughs> now this is stuck. There we go. Yeah, this is definitely lighter than the other one. It's, like, lighter than it is in the bottle, too. That's very interesting. I just want to get a lot of color. Well, not, like, a lot, but, you know, enough. Kind of equal amounts. All right, that should do it. I'm going... I put a little bit more of the Halo Glow in it than the serum. I just want to see, like... I'm really trying to test the color. Oh, that's much better. Okay. Still a little bit of color, but it's not as dark. Oops. Ew. Um, I don't think it's as dark. How's it look on camera? Definitely glowy, but yeah, I don't look as orangey as I did the last two videos. 
Ooh. Oh man, I should have gotten fair to begin with. God damn it. <laughs> That's okay. I'm even being scandalous and doing a little bit more. I'm getting stuff like everywhere. <laughs> and I mentioned in other videos, they do recommend doing this with a brush, but I just couldn't decide on a brush to use. And to be honest, who cares? <laughs> Ooh, I really like that. Oh, you guys, I goofed. I should have just gotten the color fair to begin with. <sighs> That's really funny, actually. Because I've tested this product's longevity. Like I said, I had makeup on for so long yesterday. And it was the Halo Glow mixed with the serum primer. And, like, you know, definitely over 13 hours. Like I did my makeup at like 6 or 7 a.m. and I took it off at like 11 30 p.m. Like I really really appreciate the longevity of this uh face product like combination. Good enough for now. My hands are a little sticky but that's okay. Yeah <laughs> if you're pale like me get the fair one. Don't don't take the chance. I'm so mad at myself. <laughs> That's okay, though. That is okay. All right. Now I'm going to take the uh, Born This Way Multi-Use Sculpting Concealer in Porcelain. Um, I used this the other day. It's a great match for my skin. Um, it's very sandy for a porcelain, which I thought was very interesting. Um, like, I just, when I see this color, I don't think porcelain. But, um, I have heard that Too Faced, uh, face products in general lean much more towards the warmer, yellower side. Um, I don't know. I'm not a huge Too Faced, like, fan. Like, they haven't impressed me in, like, a really long time, and I kind of, like, stopped caring about them. Um... So I don't use like a ton of their products. Like I'm new to this concealer. I just tried this concealer because uh, the other one I tried was horrible. Um, but this one, you know, this is a bestseller. So I was curious. Where's, oh, sponge. <laughs> yeah, it's very yellow on me. I might have to take this across my whole like forehead. Oh, yikes. Remember when I said this was a good match for my skin? <laughs> I think the reason I thought that is this concealer, because it's the color it is, it went better with the uh, other shade of the e.l.f. Halo Glow. Like now that I'm like really looking at my face, I think... Not so much that this concealer is a good shade for me. It's just good to make... This is a good, like, summertime color. But it's still very yellow. Wow. Yeah. I cannot get over the difference with the Elf Halo Glow. I'm so gagged by that. Holy shit. <laughs> All right, and then I'll just add more halo glow to the bottom of my face. Oh my god. Wow. Interesting. We learn as we go. Um, trying to think like order of operations here. Um, all right. So I'm going to take in the culture palette Ashanti, which is that coral green, like transforming color. Um, I'm just going to put that all over my lids because like, 
you know, very, I'm, I'm feeling very summery, very like, woo. And I'm just going to use my finger because this is a foil shade, I think. So like brushes are iffy. Oh my God. That's so fucking pretty. Oh my God. Look at that. <gasps> cool. Sorry. I like love getting excited over stuff. <laughs> Because, like, here's the thing. Christmas time in the makeup industry is fine. Because they do kind of launch stuff, like, later in the year. But, like, spring releases, like, summer releases for makeup, I feel like they go harder in the summertime than they do for holiday. Uh, holiday. Like, spring and winter, that's, like, when they go the hardest. Wow. I don't know why I'm shocked it's Juvia's place. Like, their stuff is so beautiful all the time. They have a lip gloss called Oasis that I really fucking want. Um, like, so bad. And I, uh, I should probably, hopefully get that next time I go to work on Sunday. Yeah, yesterday was truck day. We worked, well, I worked 2 p.m. to 11 p.m., That's so fierce. Look at that. So stunning. Cool. All right. Um, I should probably bring it down a little bit. A little bit more. He he he. Perfect. Cool. And no, literally no fallout. I just have a ton on my finger. That's great. Love that. All right. Um, eyeliner or no eyeliner? That is the question. Hmm. That's a tough one, guys. I haven't done eyeliner in like a couple days. I wonder. Let me just test to see how it would look by itself and then. Oh my god, we're doing it by itself. That's so cool. Are you kidding me? I was gonna do eyeliner and everything, but like just looking at it by itself with the lashes, I actually really like that. All right. We'll see if I change my mind. Because we're nowhere near done. Um, I will glue the lashes on though. Because like nobody ever looks forward to that part. Let's be real. Yeah. And then I'll fix up the rest of the face. Whee. Ew. Stray lash hair. Make sure you sanitize your lashes, guys. It's a good idea. Like, always clean them out, brush them out, pick all the fuzz and, well, God knows what else off of it, and then clean the band with, like, an alcohol wipe. Like, after you take all the glue off, just, like, alcohol them, let them dry, and then...
Oop, definitely goofed that one. That's okay. Where's the other eyelash? Oh, <laughs> it blew behind my mirror. I was like, hello? <laughs> you guys should have seen the panic. <laughs> Yeah, after today, I need to clean them. I just don't want to stop and do that right now. It's like 90 degrees out today. And I live in a place where it is still just springtime. <laughs> All right. Oh, oh, oh. oh my god, you guys. <laughs> my left eye, when it comes to my eyelashes, my left eye rides the struggle bus so hard. Like always. Cool. Good enough for now. Okay. contour first and then I'll fix down here with the halo glow. I love the way that pink looks. That's sick. Okay. So for the halo glow beauty wands, I actually got one more blush color in the color magic hour. Um, it's like a bronzy, uh, shade. Um, and I'm just going to mix that with the contour just so it's got like a warmer hue to it. Like not, not warmer. What's the word I'm looking for? You know, it's just, it's a little bit more, sparkly glowy as opposed to just a contour. I don't know. I don't even know if it's going to work out. I'm just giving it a try. <laughs> just giving her the old college try. And then I'll do my nose completely separately. We'll talk about that. I gotta be quick because if I'm not quick, it'll be kind of weird to blend out. That sounds like a negative. It's really not. I just... Whoops, too much. Shit. That is okay. We'll just spread it out some more here. Um, oh shit. That's alright. I squeezed a little too hard, so... This is gonna look fucking nuts. That's alright. <laughs> just go with the flow. Ooh. 
Okay. Actually. All right, cool. Um, let's see how the other side comes out. Because that's pretty darn cool. Good to note. Good color combo. Uh, definitely lighter next time. But like I said, I accidentally squeezed the tube a little too hard. Which is my own fault. User error. Cool. All right. Beige rainbow across the forehead. All right. Now let me go in and attempt to do my nose. <sighs> I forgot the brush for my nose. Oh my God. Sorry, <laughs> forgot my brush. All right, um, should I try? Let me just see what I can do. Okay, all right, cool. Don't want to get too excited because I could ruin it at literally any second. All right. And then I can go in with concealer and lighten it up again if I have to. I think I probably should. Okay, cool. Not the worst I've ever done. <laughs> oh, but I do need to... Mm. Let me see if I can... Oh, you know what? Actually... I know exactly what to grab to fix this. Hang on. Speaking of a contouring hero. <laughs> All right, I know this is lighter than the rest of my concealer, but I literally just need a little bit to like make some clarity here. Like I'm not even gonna squeeze the tube. I'm just gonna use like what's on the brush. Cause again, I just need a little bit. Cool. Let on the new. See, I didn't even, I literally didn't even squeeze the tube. <laughs> All right. I'm just going to use my finger to just like tap it a little bit. That's better. Okay. Not perfect, but better. Sorry. <laughs> if anybody remembers Jenna Marbles, let me know. Because she was cool. Crap. 
cardinal sin of adding more <laughs> color. It's just because the top of my face is so warm because of the concealer. Ooh, better. I'm very shiny though. <laughs> So here's my conundrum. I have the regular Fenty Balm, which is just regular silver, but because of the like green reflect, I kind of want to do like a greenish blue highlight, and I feel like that may be the choice to make, especially when I just looked at it next to each other. I try to be prepared for a video, I swear. I just keep changing minds. Uh, greenish blue. Greenish blue. Oh, that's more blue. I have a lot of blue highlighters, but like green blue, not so much. I used to have a green one. That's gold. That's not going to work. Oh my goodness. Oh, wait. Oh, that's very bright, though. Alright, I think I have a plan. Alright, I have a plan. <laughs> Ow. Injured. And I forgot the brush I was going to grab. You know what? That's okay. So this by Terra... Terra Moon Cosmetics, this particular one, the uh, shade Lightyear. It's very similar to the mono, not monochromatic, the like greenish that's happening here. So like, I'm going to do this on the inner corner very carefully since I forgot a fucking brush. And then on my nose, I'm going to use this by Kaleidos um, Cosmetics. This is the, one of the space highlighters they did last year. Um, this one's like pink and green and gold, so I think this will work too. <coughs> yeah. Alright, I'm going to start with the nose because I at least have a brush for the nose happening. <laughs> work. That's so pretty. All right. Look at that. That's so cool. Oh, I gotta do like a little over here for sure. Just like a little bit. So pretty. Okay. Good idea. Cool. Okay. And then a little on my top lip, even though I'm not doing a lip color. At least I don't think I am. Like I said, a lot of this has been me changing my mind over and over. <laughs> okay, perfect. This is such a cool highlighter. Oh my god. I have a couple of them. I used to have the full collection, but a couple of them broke, and then I gave a couple away. So I have like four or five left because it was a big highlighter collection. Um, but they were all space themed. I have, yeah, four or five of them left. This is one of them. They're really impressive uh, highlighters. I just, I don't know. Did I grab that? I didn't grab the palette. That's okay. I'm going to do a little darker on my forehead. I feel like my cheeks and my forehead are like not on the same page. Oh. 
I um I know that my looks are like different time to time. Um I do lean more towards like colorful, clowny, like goth. This whole like glow thing I'm doing right now. I'm just experimenting. Um, you know, my hair is different. Um you know, I, I haven't been as I don't have as much energy for makeup as I have in the past. Um, it comes and goes. It's like a creative thing. Nothing's wrong or anything. Um, but yeah, I just, uh, I lost my train of thought. Oh no. <laughs> oh, experimenting. Yeah. I'm just, I'm just trying different things. And you know, these literally just came out and you know, I do get the chance to check stuff out when I'm the one building the displays, I'm the one putting the products out on the shelf. Like it, I notice things. So, you know, I'm just experimenting. All right. I have to be so careful with this. They're single pans. That's how they sell them. And they make such a mess if you drop them or anything. They're just, they're so pigmented. Like they just, it looks like a crystal. Look at that. Uh, sorry, I keep like getting all up in the, uh, all right, let's hope for the best. Really wish it was a brush. Ooh, that's fire. Okay. I definitely, oh shit. It's a little, it's a little flaky, like right out of the pan. So it's easy to pick up too much, like I just did. Ooh, but you know what? Um, I don't know actually. Because I gotta put the other color on the brow bone. Um, I'll just do a little, like, dude. Dude. There, that didn't go to waste. I just put some randomly in the corner. Maybe I can. Oh, there we go. I didn't waste it. I just made the pink on the bottom a little bit more reflective and fun. All right. Now that I almost made a huge mess, time to put it away. I feel like I'm handling like uranium. Like I'm just, just like, oh no, gotta put the glitter away without making a mess. Ugh. I think um I think this is one of their chameleon pigments. I forgot what they're called, but Terra Moon Cosmetics is no joke. They are so beautiful. You can find them on Instagram. They have a billion colors and they're all like you know, iridescent and reflective and, you know, multiple colors at once. Some of them are highlighters, some of them aren't. Like, they just have so many options. Um, sorry, I'm just going to do highlight on my brow bone because I forgot to do that. I got my eyebrows done recently. That's the only reason they look this good because let me tell y'all something. You've seen my other videos. You know how bad it gets. Very funny, though, at least. Can't win them all. Really trying to pack on the highlighter here. Pretty. Very pretty. That looks really cool. I'm actually very pleased with that. Um, 
What am I missing? I feel like I'm missing something. And I don't know what. Probably a lip color, but I don't really have anything pink. At least I don't think so. <sighs> Let's get up for the 80th time and take a look. Let's see, pink. Oh yeah, I really don't have anything pink. Oh dear. Alright, well that's what's a good like pretty nude or something. Or just a lip gloss actually. Ooh. Actually, y'all, you know what? So I've talked about in the past my favorite clear gloss is by Lime Crime. And they re-released the cherry glosses. Um, and there's this like green one. Um, it's called Cherry Slime. But like, look at that. That's so cool. So I'm going to give this a try. I don't know if it's, I mean, it's a lip gloss, like commercially, but I don't know if it's supposed to be a lip topper. Um, cause I don't know how thick the glitter is. It looks very large. Smells like candy. Mm. Yeah, that's kind of what I was afraid of. These are really big chunks of glitter. Still cute. You can kind of see it. I don't know. Okay, good to know. Not really worth the hype. Just get the clear one because that really is the best one. That's no joke. I'll stand by that. Um, okay, so I'm going to spray my face and let my hair down and we'll go from there. Fan. This is the second time I almost forgot my fan. Right on. That actually looks kind of cool. <laughs> That's funny. Uh, oh, God. <laughs> That's how you know your dry shampoo works. Your hair moves around. All crazy and fluffy. Okay, so great products. Um, finally happy that I realized that I'm the shade fair. Solves a lot of problems that I had with this product. Not a lot, but you know, at least I can wear my color so I don't look as orangey in public. This is actually like, this is as orange as it is on camera. It's like not like, it goes better. I may even put it on my clavicle actually. Fuck okay, it, let's do that. Oh, I have a sponge. Okay, good. I was like, I don't really have a brush <laughs> that I'm willing to use for that. I don't want to use a lot because it's not my face. <laughs> Uses a lot anyway. Oops. I'll just do them both. Cool. 
This product is really fucking cool. Like I, it's, I get it. It's very gimmicky, but it's a good gimmick. It's a good summertime gimmick to have, I think. Or I guess springtime. I don't know. This technically came out in the winter, but. It's a good product. I mean, I stand by what I've said before. Like, it's a good product. It's not, like, the second coming. Like, everybody made it seem. Um, especially now that these are out. Like, these... Not to sound shitty, but, like... If I had to choose between this product and these... These should have came out first. Um, this is a really cool product, but... As far as... Uh, The frequency of use, um, you know, like, it, it, like in a supply versus demand type of way, like these would have, if these came out first, it would have made more sense to me. And then like this came out after, like more towards the summertime, um, or springtime. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's 90 degrees today. Ugh. Um, but yeah, that's like my only like weird thing is I feel like these should have been the focus instead of these, but it's a great line. You know, they're part of, they're both part of the same elf line. They are great. Um, you know, <laughs> at the end of the day, I just feel like a dumbass because I got the wrong color of this for so long. Um, but you know what? Now I know. And Ooh, shiny. Oh, look at that. That's pretty. Yeah, no, it's definitely, this is a good body and face product. Um, yeah. Oh, and just the, uh, Juvia's culture palette, like so, so pretty. Um, again, that's the color I'm wearing on my lids. It's the pink with the green reflect. Just look, uh, I can't wait. Like, look at that. Oh my God. Uh, can't wait. Anywho, um, I think this buffoonery has gone on long enough. Um, <laughs> So, uh, yeah, thanks for joining me. This is just a random little, um, to do cause I was bored. <laughs> um, yeah, I hope everybody has a great day. I hope it's warm where you are. And if it's not, then I hope that you at least have a nice day in general. Um, yeah. See you guys next time.